Hey guys, it's me and today I'm bringing you a video showing you how to update the firmware on your Bose SoundLink Color 2 speaker. Now this speaker is prone to an issue which if you've seen my last video you'll know about. When the power is depleted, it won't power back on. At least that is before you update the firmware. Um, I've updated the firmware on this one, this very same speaker, and since then I let the power go down to zero. I left it like that for a couple of days powered it back up and it came back on straight away so this really really does work and um, it will get your speaker working the way it should so with that all said uh, what you need to do is have the speaker have a computer whether that's a laptop or a mac and then also have the usb cable which connects from the speaker and connects to the computer so with those things in place, the next thing you'll need is the actual web page. Now, you don't need to download any software for this. You just need to go to a web page, then connect the speaker. So let me show you the web page first. I have it just here on another tab. And it is the address for it is HTTPS BTU.Bose.com. I've put that on a notepad here. So if you want to take that down, HTTPS colon slash slash btu dot bose dot com so when you go to this web page you'll um, see a fancy graphic which i've bypassed because i'm on the page uh, and it says bose updater bose updater is ready connect your product to your computer using the usb cable provided and a little bit more so what we'll do then is connect the cable i connect my cable here you hear a beep my speaker is currently on you can see there's a light there and on the screen you will see it says sound link color to bluetooth speaker so it's detected by speakers uh, a picture of one this is a red one and um, it says your product is up to date if you'd like to update a different product connect to your connect it to your computer if you're done you can disconnect your product and quit the app so mine has been updated as i say however if yours hasn't it will then ask you to proceed to do an update. The update takes between about five, five, seven, ten minutes, something like that. And as I say, once it's complete, you won't suffer from the issue of powering down and not being able to power up. So I hope this helps and you know gets your music up and running again. If it has, uh, please do leave a comment because when other people come, they'll see that it's worked and they'll be you know more infused to try. And hopefully, they can leave a comment and say it's worked for them as well. Thank you very much for choosing my video. Um, hope you have a great day and um, catch you soon. Bye.